Yo, yo, what's up everyone? Hope everyone's having a great day. In today's video, we're gonna be opening up and reviewing the brand new 2022 update series, Topps Chrome Baseball. So we, we've already opened up a pretty good amount of the Topps update series paper version. Very excited to finally get my hands on some of the Chrome mega boxes. In this year's mega boxes, there's 10 packs per box with four cards per pack for 40 cards total. On the back, here's everything that we're gonna be chasing after, hopefully, we can pull some nice color. Be really cool to pull one of the chasers, look for autographs and one of one super fractors. So without any further ado, the guys we're chasing after, we want Julio, we want Bobby Witt, we want Wander. And uh, I've been having an absolute blast with uh, baseball lately. I know typically I don't open, let me get these packs out real quick. Put that back there so typically i don't open too much baseball but i've had more fun opening baseball recently than any other sport so figured i would keep it up this rookie class is just absolutely so much fun to chase after and collect so without any further ado everyone say a prayer to the card gods and let's get active our first pack of uh chrome update whoa we got a purple already first pack i think at least Starting it off with Cole Sanos, Royce Lewis. I like the chrome look to it though, really nice looking. We got a now generation Juan Soto, and it's a purple refractor of Ram Ramon Urias, which is not numbered. Oh, I'm wrong. Cool though, nice little purple parallel. I'm not gonna sleeve that right now. I, I could have swore that was gonna be numbered, but. It must be like the parallel you get for every box. Looks really nice. Let's keep it going. All right, we got another purple back there, so it must be pretty common. <laughs> we got Odor, Tyler, we got rookie Connor Pilkington, and another purple. Purple is gonna be a rookie, Nick Lodolo. These purples are very beautiful cards. I wonder if you get one per pack. That'd be cool. So we got another one. So yeah, they must be one per pack. That's pretty cool. We got Scherzer, Nick Paveda, Ron Marinaccio, and a purple of Austin Meadows. wonder if you can pull like SPs and SSPs from these. Should have looked before. Like I pulled the Julio SP. I wonder if they have like that card, this Chrome. I don't think they have any of the uh, home field advantage inserts either. So there are some differences between update and Chrome that I've noticed. I'm not, ooh, is that a gold? It's probably just an insert. Yeah. All right, we have Gary Sanchez. Eric Fade, we got a rookie of oh, nice O'Neill Cruz, beautiful card, and our purple is a rookie. Oh, ho, ho. let's go, baby! What the heck is the centering on this? And it has like some card scuffs down there. Jeez, this is like a PSA negative ten. Very happy to have this one, but I've been seeing a lot of people complain about the quality control in an update series, and I'm seeing it myself now, firsthand. Beautiful card, though. I'm not. I'm not too mad about that. Nice pack, sick O'Neill Cruz. That's what the back looks like. Let's leave that up for now. All right, we got six packs to go in the first box. We've already uh. I'm happy already. Wonder if that little scuff will come off. I hope it does. We've got a microfiber cloth. I'll take two after the video. We got Kikuchi, Chase Silseth, CJ Abrams, rookie debut, and Jacob Stallings on the back. I don't know whether to be happy or upset about that Bobby Witt. <laughs> I guess I, I should just be happy I pulled it because I could have not pulled it. 
Um, we got Freddie Freeman, Jock Peterson. Um, looks like a nice Roberto Clemente, Tops Chrome. It's got like a fingernail indent right here by my thumb. Not numbered. And then Carlos Correa on the back. Look how off center this one is too. They must have have the printers going crazy and they couldn't get the quality right. All right, moving along, we got Diego Castillo, Josh Lowe, Frank Thomas. It's pretty cool. This one doesn't appear to have any fingernail indents in it, so that's cool. And we have a Mike Clevenger on the back. The center. I think all the purples are just terribly centered, it seems like. Tops wanted to take notes out of Panini's bag. Take after them real quick. Let's move along here. Austin Meadows. Jose Trevino. Ooh, got another Bobby Witt. Take that. It's the rookie debut, but I'm not upset. And a Yankee. Jose Trevino on the back again. Can't be too upset with a nice Bobby Witt box. Our last two packs. We got Nick Lodolo, Jacob Stallings, got a refractor of Mike Trout. That's a cool card. Centering again is just terrible, but really nice looking card here. wonder if that's like a, actually, I don't think there are SPs in here. Happy to have it though. And our last pack of box one. It's been a pretty solid box. Outside of the centering issues. It's been fun. Alright, we have Gabriel Arias. Edward Cabrera. Steven Matz. And our last purple of the box. is going to be Odor again. Alright, so box number one is in the books. Not a bad little box, honestly. Let's go... Move on to box two. Hopefully uh, we don't have as many quality issues in box two. All right, put this back here. We got 10 more packs. These are fun boxes to rip open, it sucks. I don't know if I've already said this or not, but these boxes retail at $49.99, so they're not cheap. So I hope box number two can uh, give us some nice cards. Right, we got Jorge Soler, Brad Miller, Refractor of Xander Bogarts. Looks like one of them all-star ones. And purple of John Gray on the back. I want to pull a numbered card. That is the goal here. We got Joe Prez, Shane Baz, Steven Matz, and purple. It's a rookie. We're looking at Nick Ladolo. Finally, like a decently centered purple it's not great but it's it's better than most purples i've noticed still haven't pulled our guy julio yet all right we have nico austin nola connor pilkington and it's a rookie Brandon Marsh, not terrible. Again, centering does not appear to be an issue on this one. Knock on wood. We have six packs to go. 
We have AJ Pollock, Michael Fulmer, Jordan Alvarez, Generation Now, Absolute Beast, and a purple rookie of Adrian Martinez. A lot of purple rookies this box, opposed to the last box. I think we only got a couple in that last one. We're down to our last. We got six more packs to go. Still have not pulled a numbered card. That's the goal here. Come on, card gods. Got to come through. We got Josh Winder, O'Neill Cruz, the debut. We got a refractor of Manny Machado. It's a cool card. And purple rookie of Suzuki. Nice. It's a rookie hot box. Can't be too upset with that one. Seems like the second box is more more like quantity hits where the first box delivered the big boy we're halfway through box two it's been a pretty fun box we have brendan donovan mackenzie gore alex thomas and purple anderson Severino. another rookie we're getting hooked up with all the rookies should probably start sleeping them just in case but do all that after the video coming down to the wire here folks all right we have sergio jason Crizan, cj abrams again and purple another rookie ethan roberts seems like every purple i've got in this box is our yeah, almost every purple has been a rookie. All right, Cole San, Royce Lewis. Another Juan Soto genera now generation. Another rookie purple, Jose Miranda. Looks pretty nice. Dude hit 30 home runs last year. Nice, nice, nice. At least we're getting a bunch of rookies. See if we can go out with two more. All right. Corey Seager. Ryan Pe Pepeout, Pepeout, I think. <laughs> Chipper Jones. It's a cool one. I like these inserts. And, oh my God, let's go, baby. We got the purple Julio, two boxes, two bangers. Let's, this box has been loaded. Wow. So the $50 box has paid off, thank goodness. Centering is definitely not what we're looking for, but at least we pulled the card, man. I'm not mad about that at all. Those two look real nice together. And they're not the rookie debut, which is what that purple is. It's the real deal. Now let's open up our last pack. Sadly, this has been fun. All right, we got Scherzer. Nick Paveda again. Sean... Manea, let's see if we can go out on another purple rookie. Oh my goodness, another rookie. Jaron Duran. This box was absolutely amazing. All right. That is going to do it for this box. I am absolutely speechless or for these two boxes. Let's go over all the pulls. Can't be mad about that at all. Look at all these purples. So, just do a little recap from our two mega box review. We got pretty much every purple rookie you could ask for. Manny Machado, All-Star, Suzuki, got O'Neill Cruz, Brandon Marsh, the Trout was a nice hit. Frank Thomas. Let's look at all these. Cruz. And then the two best pulls of the break of the review by far. Julio and Bobby Whip Tops Chrome Update Purple Refractors. So let's go. Can't complain with that. Overall, I would rate my personal experience a 9 out of 10. 
can't complain with that with that rip at all obviously we could have used a numbered uh parallel but can't be upset it's gonna do it for this review if you guys enjoyed you know what to do show some love as always like comment subscribe all of that and peace out